Giants fan here with Daniel Jones, two first round picks and a third. Set me up, Get huh? it done for Deshaun Watson. Johnny repeat, G. Repeat the package for me. Repeat the package for me. The potential trade package. I'll, I'll repeat it. The potential trade package is Daniel Jones, two first round picks and a third. Would that be enough for the Giants? Uh, or for the Texans, rather, to trade away Deshaun Watson, and is that something the Giants would want to do? Resident Giants fan Johnny Gonzalez, go for it. I would say in a vacuum, yes, that would be enough. But in practice, no. Because if that's available for the Giants, then the Jets are making the same deal with Darnold, and the league values Darnold higher. Does that make sense? Like, the Jets would make that exact deal to get Deshaun Watson if it was on the table. Right. And I think you would rather that deal from the Jets to get Darnold, if you're the Texans, than you would from the Giants to get Daniel Jones. Just because I think we saw this year, and I, you know, I give Daniel Jones all the excuses in the world, but I think at the end of the day, what we saw this year is that the ceiling isn't higher. With The floor might be higher for Jones, that he might settle into being a better player than Sam Darnold. But I think that Sam Darnold has the star potential that Daniel Jones doesn't necessarily have. And I, I, I think you'll see the Giants probably, you know, be really into Daniel Jones and what he does this year. Because it's, it's a, let's be realistic, it's a make or break year for Daniel Jones. Like, he's had his time in the limelight. Now it's time to get serious. I told y'all that I didn't want to criticize Daniel Jones yet because I thought that the Giants had, you know, you know, his receivers were dumpster fires and his offensive lines were dumpster fires. Saquon got hurt and the defense was garbage. And But the Giants have a real team now. Like the Giants aren't a dumpster fire anymore. And it's time to put up a shut up if you're Daniel Jones. And if I'm the Giants, if that deal's available, obviously I take it. But, I, you know, if I'm the Texans, I, I think I could probably still get more, you know, if I'm holding out. And, you know, I think there's a whole lot of league politics surrounding Deshaun Watson that we can get into another day. But, uh, you know, I think I think it's a tough it's a tough move and it's a good trade package. But there are probably better deals out there if the Texans are willing to really get uncomfortable. And I think they're really willing to get uncomfortable. Yeah, the, I mean, look, there, there's a potential trade package that would involve a first round pick in Jimmy G that's been floated around that I think honestly, if we're, if we're being real, probably better. It, it, I mean, look, look, yeah, I don't know. Actually, I don't even know about that. It, it's, it's weird. It's, that, 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 it's weird. It's a weird position for the Texans to be in too. Cause you also have to evaluate like where the other team's going to be with Deshaun Watson as well. Are the jets yeah. who's in a better position to, to win or with Deshaun Watson? Is it the jets uh, or is it the the Giants, you know? And then, like, those are two teams that I think are, you know, like, let's say with Deshaun Watson even, I would say pretty evenly matched. I'm not going to yeah, lie. Um, I'd agree. No, I'd agree. I mean, I mean the, 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 the thing the Giants will always have uh, that, that would probably make people think is the fact that they're in the NFC East. And they have a higher likelihood with a bad record to – uh, maybe make the playoffs as the winner of that division. Like they could go seven and nine, maybe win that win that division. <laughs> they would have to win seven games first. They haven't done that in a little bit while. Uh, but and then, two then draft picks Giants skyrockets. references. Two Giants two, references. Two six and ten. Two six and ten references. Okay, all right. All hey, right, hey, all right. I, 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 I mean, I'm, I'm just being real. Real take sports talk. That's the show. Thanks for watching this video from Real Take Sports Talk. Remember to like, share, subscribe, hit that notification bell so you get notified whenever a new video is released. Also remember to check out our live show every single Thursday at 8 p.m. right here on the YouTube channel. And remember, keep it real.